This is the review of the air rifle made by Crossman, the Benjamin Trial MP or weather. As you can see on the box, it is using 0.22 caliber. The velocity is 950 feet per second by using the alloy pellet. And when using regular lead pellet, it's, it is 800 FPS. The muzzle energy is 21 feet per pound. This one comes with a belt and it is using nitro te technology. And it reduced the noise up to 70%. Um, I don't have a noise monitor device, so I cannot really say is it true. And uh, also, I don't have. Uh, the velocity measuring meter, so I just go with what the box says. And this one, well, consider semi unboxing since I already opened it. And I actually made a video before, but it was not good enough, so this is kind of a remake. So the body part looks like this all black, the body. Uh, the, the barrel part, of course, is by steel. And the body part is by ABS, and or saying the other way is a plastic steel. You may check online what does ABS stand for. It's a very long three words, and sorry I cannot pronounce it. And this part is rub. This part actually is still ABS the body part, but they make it like a, uh, I'm not sure how to describe it, but it's grinded so. It increased the stability when you hold the gun. And the bottom part, I'm not sure can you see it, it has a B, a B mark. And uh, the end part is rubber. And the feeling of this body is really, really good. The scope is center point, 3-9 times 40 mm. Um, some people say this one is not good so they use other brands. Um, I am more like a beginner so as a beginner this one actually works very good for me. The trigger uh, right now I have the lock on. The lock is right in front of the trigger. When you, when you are going to fire just I think you can see there's a lever. Sorry, probably it's not obvious enough. Really. Okay, as you can see, there's a small piece in front of the trigger, and when you are going to fire, you have to move it to this position, unlock. If you are going to do something else, then just push it backward. It's like lock up. As you can see, the piece right now is close to the trigger. The trigger. Uh, it's the same two stage, but just by using the manufacturer setting, it actually is really, really good. Okay, and the belt, the belt, the quality of the belt is really good too, and it has a very nice Benjamin word on it. Overall quality of this air rifle, I would say it's really, really nice, and the Especially I'm a beginner, so using this one is really nice to me, helping me build up my skills and interest of using a rifle very fast. And the only thing is, um, uh, this one is about 8 pounds. Let me see. The box says, yeah, I remember the box is saying it is 8 pounds. Yes. The whole body is 43 inch long. The weight is 8 pounds. So, uh, for people who are going to use, consider buying this one, just be aware it has some weight. And so, the way how I shoot, uh, because I, I don't have strong muscle as other users, so the way how I shoot, it, my right hand is definitely, uh, sorry, because my, I'm using one hand to film it, so I cannot really hold the gun in my... My right hand holds here, and uh, when I'm shooting, my left hand is like, 
I put it this way instead of holding it like here because in this way my arms are like open in open position normally this is a better way but uh, as a uh, as I didn't trim my muscle that much as other people's shooting in this position holding close like this my left hand is like this and my right, right hand is just like regular people hold here and my and my right hand index finger to here shooting this way actually makes more stable stable situation for me okay and the bag I choose to use is the the bone collector and this one is for, uh, up to 44 I remember it's 44 inch long bag this is, this is a nice bag too I pre I previous was using the other one but the other one the, good, the other box uh, I think it's slight well the, the other one you you um, I'm, I forgot the name but the other one which was good but it was too long it, it was for guns that up to 50 inch and it's just hard to put them in, in my car so this bag has a nice padding inside and the two big pocket zip bag pocket and uh, the zips you can actually go all the way up and it has the the holes for, for you to to lock so people uh, people will not buy, buy ask them to open your bag easily okay so this is just a brief sorry, a brief open box and now um, I want to show you the results of you of some shooting result as you can see in my other, other video I was using this one and it's just the uh, um, Benjamin discovery 0.22 caliber 400 count assortment pellet which was excellent that was the, the pellet that I love to use and uh, the quality of the pellets was very good and very clean but today when I went out I forgot to bring that pellet so the results of that pellet probably you have to go back to see my other video and I apologize again uh, the video probably not made in really good condition so I, I will remake it again today when I went out at least I remembered to pro this the gamma assortment pellets. Uh, let me see. Box. Is this pellet com? Sorry, gamma combo pellet pack with the T22 Master Point Hunter and Magnum. Um. Today when I'm shooting, I think the only thing from Gamo for this Benjamin trial MPO weather, I think only this one is the, the Hunter. Is the pellet that this air gun like to to shoot? Because all the other three, I don't get a result that I, I, I like. And plus, this gun I zero well pretty much. Zero. I, I should I say zero. Pretty much zero by um that Benjamin trial. No, sorry, the Benjamin pellet. So probably different companies brand shows some different accuracy. But at least when this hunter can still go with the, the same uh, accuracy situation. All the other three just kind of off. The result, um, I shoot with these three big plastic bottles. I shoot with these, these three. And each one is plastic but kind of thick. Uh, the plastic bottle, each side is about maybe, maybe about this thick, each side. Maybe. As you can see, let me open. As you can see, it's about like this situation, the, the bottle. 
And the O3 bottle today when I was shooting, um, fully filled with water to the top. And the shooting result. The first one, as you can see, and I was standing at 50 yards, yes, 50 yards away. I was zero in my rifle in that position. So, um, the result, I didn't mark it, but today I, I mainly it's just to try the result, so I didn't really care which pellet do what, and plus the accuracy was not good as, as I expect. Maybe I moved the scope, so I need to re re-zero the scope, but basically just to let you know, with this kind of plastic bottle at 50 yards, uh, pretty much what they can do, and fully filled with water, well, pretty much what they can do in, I remember that these two holes that you see that penetrate through, these two, I remember, remember they were shot by the hunter. The other two dots that you see white, that means they didn't penetrate through. Oh, actually, three. That means it didn't, it didn't, didn't went all the way through. And these were actually very ridiculously. Are uh, those two holes were made by the master point, which is specific for the hunter, and also the magnet, which is also for the energy for, for penetration, and they did, they wasn't able to penetrate. So that was the first bottle. Second bottle result looks like this. Again, fully filled with water at 50 yards. And uh, again, the one that I punched through was by Hunter. This one was by Hunter too. The lower one was by. This one still went through, but I forgot which which pillar it was using. And the, the top, I was shooting with the. I remember it was the. Um, Magnet. It's shot to here, as you can see, a little bit grayish, and then pop the top. The bigger bottle, a mm, bigger bottle probably because it's wider, as you can see, compared to the other two. As you can see, the, the width is totally different totally increased and so as the, the more water inside more resistant force is inside so none of the pellet went through which is okay and because I was mainly for the bottle uh, sorry for the target shooting so penetrate or not penetrate doesn't matter but all the holes were pretty much made by the hunter because <laughs> I remember I was using again I was using all four of them only this hole was the one in the center was by the um, magnum or the master point all the others were made by the hunter which was specific for in impact Okay, so again, the front side went through clean. This one, again, it was either by Magnum or the Master Point, and these two. So, at a 50 yard, with the velocity of 800 feet per second, fully filled, a uh, plastic bottle fully filled with water, only the Hunter pellet, which was specific for impaction, can at least do some damage. All the others can still do damage, but not as great as the Hunter pellet. So this is a brief review of the Gamma pellet, and also the Benjamin Trail MPO Weather Air Rifle.
uh, thank you for the watch and um, I will see if they, there is some other special target I can try on to test the quality of the pellet, quality of the air rifle and uh, shooting results. Thank you.